What are we doing this morning? Good morning. We're here at the 41 location getting ready to go to the um, Lighthouse Ministries to give out food and clothing for all the needy for the Christmas season. Good morning, love first. This is Pastor Jay here. We are here in Ruskin and we're doing our Ruskin outreach. It's an awesome thing to show the love of God. Today we're supplying food, clothes for those in need. In this winter season, many do not have warm clothes. Isn't it an awesome thing for the love of Jesus to cover people in warmth? Brothers and sisters, this is what love first is all about. This is what God's all about. Feeding the hungry, taking care of the orphans, helping the widows. Family, we must all understand we have a role to play and I thank you for all you're doing, the gifts, the seeds, the food. We're nothing without God. I love you. God bless you. Can't wait to see you out here next time. God bless you, love first. Bye-bye. Hi, this is Dora Cruz from the Lord's Lighthouse Ministry. And we have an exciting day today. Pastor Jomo from Love First a Christian Center came with some lay people and they are blessing all our farm workers uh, that come today, which is a large number. And the uh, public in general, that is very, families that are extremely poor, they come here to the ministry, to the mission, what we call it, and, and they, they will be fed. Because Jesus asked us to feed the hungry and dress the naked and preach the good news of salvation to the poor. That's what we're doing here in the name of Jesus. And the beauty of this ministry is that what we give to them, because we don't sell anything, is because of the blessings that Christians who have more share with those who have less. Well, we used to be very wealthy. We had, uh, we always had new Cadillacs every year. We traveled all over Europe and Asia. We had housekeepers. Uh, we had uh, nice parties, catering, nothing but the best. Uh, my husband would buy me jewelry in uh, Europe. Uh, we didn't have to worry about anything. Our homes were paid for. And then things just happened. We met it go. And, just whatever. And so oh, really? and now, wow. here I am. <laughs> I never thought this day would come. Right. And uh, my husband is, uh, he has a lesion in his brain. But I pray to God because uh, maybe the doctors can't do anything, but I know the Lord can. There's no doubt in my mind. Amen. God's always with us. He may come at the 12th hour, but he will take care of us. I wish Joyce Meyer every morning. I see my prayers, read my Bible. So, I'm being taken care of. Now we don't have to worry about going hungry, because therefore, if I didn't know about these places, we would have gone hungry. It got that bad. Mm. It got that bad. Yeah. So today you were able to... Yeah, get food and go Christmas shopping. Okay. And I got the shoe because they were super glued and they're coming apart. Right, <laughs> right. I'm so proud I got shoes. <laughs> and my husband couldn't afford shoes even at, at Walmart or Payless. I can't even afford 10, 15 bucks. Mm. That's, to us, that's, that's just out of the mind. You just can't, it's uncall, you know, you just don't have it. Right. Yeah, I'm lucky if I have a doubt in my wallet. Mm. Sometimes I have change, but I've never had to charge cars, checking account. Just, 
Well, I thank you for sharing your story. Oh, you're welcome. Yeah. I'm just glad all these people are being taken care of too. And they're going to have a good Christmas.